The inputs you vary in a top-rank what-if analysis will usually contain risk-vary or possibly risk-auto-vary functions. Then with the default setting of five steps over some range, the five values will be equally spaced. For example, if the range is from 10 to 30, the five values for this input will be 10, 15, 20, 25, and 30. As an alternative, top rank allows you to enter at-risk probability distributions in an input cell. It won't simulate values from this distribution, as at-risk does. Instead, it varies the inputs over the specified number of steps so that the intervals between the values have equal probabilities. For example, if there are five steps, the values used will be the minimum, the 25th percentile, the 50th percentile, the 75th percentile, and the maximum of the distribution. These five values divide the distribution into four equal probability intervals. Actually, this is for a bounded distribution that has minimum and maximum possible values. The values selected are slightly different for an unbounded distribution like the normal distribution, but the idea is basically the same. This use of at-risk functions in top rank can be illustrated with a simple profit model shown here. It currently has risk vary functions in all of the green input cells. But the inputs in row 7 will be changed to have risk trying functions instead for the triangular distribution. Note that at risk does not have to be open to use these at risk functions. The easiest way to do this is to select one of the input cells, click the Add Input button, click the FX button to see this dialog box. Then for the type, change it to at risk distribution, and for the distribution, change it to the one you want. And click OK. Now you can change the min, the most likely, the max, the parameters of the triangular distribution to the ones you want. and they become the min, the base, and the max. Alternatively, if you prefer, you can enter the risk trying formula directly in the input cell. Once you run the what-if analysis, you can see the values used for the at-risk function inputs. There they are. Unlike the values for the risk vary inputs, these values are not equally spaced. In a sense, the values used are more representative of the specified distribution. Otherwise, however, the results can be interpreted exactly as any other top rank results. In particular, there is no randomness involved. If you run this analysis again, you will get exactly the same results.